Hello, I'm Jonathan. Hi, I'm Catherine. I don't know if you've ever felt cross about something. When something goes wrong or someone does something that upsets us, it's easy to feel cross. Anger is a feeling that all of us get. And sometimes it's a good thing to help us stand up and to speak out about something that isn't right. But sometimes anger gets out of control. I don't know if you ever felt yourself just explode with anger because you're so cross. And if we hurt anyone or anything with our anger, that's not okay. I'd like to show you a demonstration of what anger is like. You see, anger is a little bit like bicarbonate of soda or baking powder. I don't know if you've ever used it. It's a little white powder, quite like flour, that you might put in cakes. Now, I said anger is a bit like this because you need baking powder in your cakes to make them rise. How are your cakes today? Delicious. Are they really tasty? Are they nice and fluffy and light? Mm -hmm. That's because they've got baking powder in them. But sometimes if we mix baking powder or bicarbonate of soda with the wrong things and we don't look after it well, it can be a little bit different. And we'll show you what happens when you put in too much. I have to be quick here. What happens when you put in too much baking powder and if you get okay. really really cross sometimes it's a bit like a volcano exploding this one isn't very dramatic but it's making quite a big mess if you can see it's bubbling everywhere and sometimes our anger can damage things or hurt our friendships with people and that's not okay so we need to make sure that if we feel cross about something, that we use that anger to solve the problem that wasn't OK, <laughs> to use it like baking powder in cakes to make a situation better afterwards, rather than blowing up like a volcano and making a big mess. I hope that's a helpful demonstration for you guys to see what anger is like. Bye-bye. Bye. bye, bye. Mm. My mum makes the best cakes. Delicious. <laughs>